Drake Relays enjoys a perfect night for running, which works well with the popular distance carnival. Start with the girls 3,000 meters and it's back to back for Peyton Noe. The Ballard senior is one of the best ever. She defends her Drake Relays title in 9 minutes 28 seconds, just off the Relays record, but still third all time in Iowa. Yeah, my goal going into it was the record. Um, so it sucks I didn't get it, but obviously I'm not mad about the outcome. I still was able to run a pretty good race, get a PR, so I'm happy about that. To the boys, 3,200 outstanding field, and at the end, it's Pella's Chase Lohman leading the charge. Lohman wins in nine minutes, six seconds. He wins his first Drake Relays title. It's just surreal. I mean, I knew I could do it today, but I mean, just to actually get in here and like compete with the best and win it was just crazy. Into the field we go. Girls Discus, Hampton, Dumont, Cals, Charlie Morton with a monster throw. 146 feet, three inches. She wins the Drake Relays title. In the long jump, Carlisle's Isabel Noring is a two-time state champ, now a two-time Drake champ. Noring jumps 18 feet, 10 inches to defend her title. Especially since it's my last year, it feels really nice to just know that I can do something like that over and over again. It's really cool because it just boosts your confidence and you just feel like you're on top of the world the entire time. No Drake woman had won a Drake Relays title in nearly 30 years. That drought also ended tonight. Women's 3,000 meter steeplechase and coming down the stretch is Brooke Mullins. The Aussie becomes the first Bulldog woman to win a Drake Relays title since 1995 and she does it in a school record 10 minutes, 13 seconds. Uh, it means a lot. I'm just like super happy to be able to do it from this home crowd and it's like I hold great pride coming out here at the relays and yeah it's just it's been a goal of mine at the start of the season I told coach I really want to win the Drake Relays steeplechase and so it's good to go out there and do that. Northern Iowa's Carter Morton is one of the best decathletes in the country. Here's Morton sailing over the bar in the pole vault. Morton clears 4.7 meters to win. Morton takes the javelin next, then finishes with a second place finish in the 1500. That's more than enough to wrap up the decathlon. Morton never won a Drake Relays title at Greene County High School, but he has a white flag now. It's always been one of my goals to get a Drake Relays flag, and I finally got one. And um, just, yeah, like you said, it's a small town, so like anyone out there who's in a small town, like you can do anything you want. You just gotta, you just, it takes hard work though.